two advices, if I can, give to the American policy makers. Number one, get a crash course in how to deal with democracies. <clears throat> we claim democracy, but we don't know how to deal with a democracy. We are used to get our guy there, our puppet, and tell him what to do, and he does, or else. Uh, and it was easy. Honestly, it is very convenient. If I am the president of the United States, this is the best thing. I have uh, uh, a thing there, an animal there, and I tell him, go get that, he will do. Uh, uh, and it is a shocking new experience to the United States, and they will run through that, particularly in Egypt, big time. It's no more that I will talk to this general or to this president, and I, I give him to the think tanks and the analyze his personality, and I know his point of weakness, and I use him. No more of that. You will deal with 80 million people. Analyze all of them then, which will be great. <laughs> the second thing, there is no way that we keep ignoring the occupation of Palestine by Israel. <laughs> America has to wean itself off Israel. It became an addiction. It is not logical. It is not based on science. It is not politically ben beneficial. It is not in harmony with our values. We are not reaping any gains. We are losing all the way. So it became an addiction. America should go to rehabilitation.